the Supercar is 4.78 meters long, 2.26 meters wide, and only 1.136 meters high. The proportions and body parts have been calculated to improve the car's aerodynamics as much as possible. All of the aerodynamic elements are integrated into the body shell form, from the front spoiler to the rear diffuser, while the rear spoiler is deployable and controlled electronically. The 4-degree approach angle is optimized for high speed and assists directional stability at the very top end of the spectrum. The 11-degree tilt, on the other hand, delivers considerably greater downforce at mid-range speeds, helping to optimize handling and stability. Up front the Aventador gets an air guide further emphasized by glossy, black frames, and by xenon headlamps. These headlights are more than just a simple bulb behind a casing, they are an exercise in further design. The Y-shaped lights spread out from the middle and a different set of LED lights within creates the turn signal. The side of the car have two sweeping strokes, the first emphasizes the front wheel arch, the second is a very sharply drawn line beginning at the front wheel arch. Lamborghini describes it as a tensed muscle running along the entire side of the car and over the rear wheel. Also, two large air intakes behind the upward opening doors are used for a better cooling engine. Finally the rear gets a lower diffuser and rear LED lights that create the same shape as the ones out front.